All right, everyone. So in yesterday's video, I mentioned that I'd got my rain barrel project finished, but I figured that deserved its own video. So let me get this turned around and I'll show you what I've got. All right, so this is my rainwater collection system here. Um, I got this 55 gallon barrel off of Facebook Marketplace for 10 bucks. It already had the, uh, the input here spout down here and it's got a overflow that was all already installed so that saved me a lot of trouble um, so I got that I got some new gravel to put in here between the sheds to level the area off and then I constructed a base out of a cinder block some brick and a paver I was going to use pallet wood originally but I figured that that was I wasn't sure that would support the weight um, so I went with this and then I got one section of gutter cut it down a little bit and installed it here along the edge of the shed um, and I connected this downspout cut a hole in the gutter riveted this piece in place connected this downspout um, this is actually a little bit closer than I had anticipated it being but managed to get it get it hooked up there good. Now this one half of the roof is about 40 square feet. So by my calculations, about a quarter of an inch should fill this entire bale. Um, I'm gonna use this primarily for water in the garden, but it's nice to have a, a backup supply of water for an emergency. So it's just a quick update on my uh, rain barrel. Right now it's empty, but we do have some rain and some snow in the forecast for later in the week, so hopefully by next week it'll be full and I can start using it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, I'll see you at the Trailer Park Homestead.